Today I want to show you how to hook up this $15 drum switch I picked up on eBay. The way I've got it wired up, the top two sets of lugs is your off and on circuit. The second and fourth sets of lugs is your uh, reversing circuit. Now moving on to the motor, according to the wiring diagram, you're going to want to hook up T1, T3, and T8 to line 1. Line 1 being the black wire on your power cord. You're going to want to wire up T2, T4, and T6 to line 2 on your power cord. That's being the white wire. And to reverse rotation, it states to uh, switch lines T6 and T8. So those two wires are my reverse, reversing wires. Now moving on to the wiring part of it. I ran my black wire my, off the power cord to my first set of lugs right here. On the other, set of lug, on the other side of that set, I ran a jumper wire over to, over to my second set of lugs and this other red jumper wire going to my T1 and T, T1 and T3 cord plug or wires. And on my uh, neutral side, the white wire, I have that going to my T2, T4 wire, and the jumpers up going to my fourth set of lugs. Now, this wire right here on the second set row, second row, is going to my T8 wire, and this wire right here is going to my T6 wire. Now to show you how it works, you switch the switch to that direction. And you have forward rotation. Now switch it reverse. And that's how you hook up a cheap drum switch to a, a horse and a half Beaver single phase motor. Now, to see pictures of this all buttoned up with a switch mounted to the top of the motor, uh, visit my Facebook page, group page, uh, Home Built Knife Grinders, and you can see pictures of that all done. Thank you.